guys how you doing this is N1CY and we're gonna do a quick overview of this radio it's the Yesu FDM uh, 400 Delta Romeo it's a digital analog APRS uh, capable radio and what we're gonna talk about is we're gonna talk about different operation of the radio uh, now I had a hard time uh, putting the head because it has a satellite receiver on the back of it here um, and then um, it has to see the sky for the GPS uh, to work and so um, I got it up but not up enough but just up enough so it can see the satellite here's the satellite symbol right there on the top right corner that's your satellite symbol um, it has uh, a lot of cool features, several modes of communication on digital. Uh, it can transfer data. You can also have a high quality digital audio transmission. And uh, you can control everything from the mic here. Uh, I can go from band A to band B. Um, I can open the squelch. Here, I'll demonstrate that. So here's the uh, microphone here and I can change bands and so um, you can change band up and down here anyway it's really cool um, other cool features um, also I can open this the squelch uh, let me go back to band A here. Open the squelch. Um, go to band B, go to the home channel. That's home channel right there. I can do that from the mic. I can also uh, change the power output. I can also um, go to this uh, nifty screen, it will show a compass and uh, I do apologize for the uh, reflection there, the glare. Uh, this is also another screen, it's an uh, elevation screen, it shows you the elevation, the current elevation right there. And uh, press it one more time, takes you back to uh, the home screen. Uh, now, like I said, this is an APRS radio, and so to activate the APRS function, what we can do is we can go to display here and choose APRS, turn the modem on, it's off now. And what you do is you turn the modem on and then you exit, you press back twice and then you go to function right here. But before I do that, I'm going to go to the APRS channel. So put it in VFO. This is VFO. This is the uh, APRS. Okay, let me turn the audio down. There we go. And let's go to function here. Okay, what you do is you go to the beacon and you have to turn the beacon on which I did by pressing on beacon and you see this icon on the upper right corner that dot 
that means the beacon is on. So now you're transmitting. And of course, I already programmed my call sign N1CY-9. And uh, so now we're doing APRS. So you turn the modem on, you turn the beacon on, and you're all good to go. Okay, so this is a sh uh, just a short overview of the radio. I'll go over more features with you a little bit later. Um, it's a really cool radio. All right, so right now, the beacon is turned on, the modem is turned on, and you see that dot on the top right corner, that means you're in transmit. And I have five minute intervals for transmit. Okay, so anyway, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll catch you a little bit later. Love the radio, the audio is phenomenal. Good quality, the display is really cool. And uh, let me put it back. Looks like I, hold on a second here. Let's go to, there we go. These are all APRS stations nearby. If it's a mobile station, it will show you on the compass uh, the location of the station and it will show you how far they are from you, like in this instant. So it's really, really cool. If you want to transmit and not wait for the interval, just go back, hit function and you press on Beacon TX, right there, Beacon TX. And so if I press on that, now I transmit it right there. So it's really, really cool. Anyway, thanks for watching again. Uh, the world of APRS you could do live tracking on the internet and it's really really cool mm. easy guys I think my dog just saw a squirrel they're getting uh, they're getting uh, <laughs> active in the, in the background there this station is nearby right there you see the green dot that's the location of that station uh, with regard to my location here. Alright, again, thank you for watching.